for the 2000 GT you only own twice. Welcome to this collections video. Even though the Toyota 2000 GT wasn't entirely 100% Toyota, as Yamaha actually built all of them, including the all aluminium body and the double overhead cam heads. Still, the Toyota 2000 GT was recognized as the first Japanese supercar, and it impressed the international press of what Japan and Toyota were capable of. This particular Toyota 2000 GT is an early 1967 left-hand drive model and is part of the Laumann collection and exhibited in the Laumann Museum in The Hague. You can tell it's an early model by the larger driving lamps, the shape of the front turn signal lamps and the smaller rear turn signal lamps. The owner, Evert Laumann, also owns another early left-hand drive model and this has been exhibited in the Dutch Toyota Museum in Raamonsphere. And fun fact, is that the 2000 GT actually never got sold in the Netherlands. The car in the museum in The Hague has been imported in 2006, while the one in the museum in Raamdonk Sphere has been imported already in 1976. That also means that he owns two out of the 85 left-hand drive 2000 GTs. And did I already mention that he likes rare and exclusive cars? Let's go quickly through the checklist. Steve McQueen's 1971 Barra Buggy Check. One of the original James Bond Aston Martins used in Goldfinger. Check. Lexus LFA with serial number 001. Check. Toyota 7 Turbo Race Car. Check. The only remaining Toyota AA dragged from a Russian barn. Check. Dr. Sochiro Toyota's Company Century. Check. Dr. Sochiro Toyota's Desk. Check. We can only dream of owning one single car out of this amazing collection. And if you're in The Hague or nearby, I would definitely recommend going to the museum. It's definitely worth it. 